And ahead, some new data has South Carolina drivers gripping their steering wheels just a little tighter than usual. Our Ali Espinosa digs into those numbers and tells us how some locals are working to fight the issue they raise themselves. A new USA Today report shows South Carolina ranks 15th in the country for pothole problems, leaving some folks here in the Grand Strand to take matters into their own hands. It's kind of like fixing a cavity in your tooth. Dan Cinema has been fixing potholes for years in his neighborhood of Island Green after noticing city and county officials weren't doing much to patch them up. I see every imperfection in every road that I'm driving down, and, uh, and I want to fix it. While Cinema can rely on his handiness to fix up roads, he can't always rely on his wallet. With data showing average potholes costs a little less than $500 each to fill in. That's why his neighbors have been stepping in for years, donating money for him to buy supplies and keep their streets safe. Despite the high cost of repairs, Cinema tells me looking out for himself and his neighbors is always worth it. All I know is if, if something costs me a couple hundred dollars, it's a hardship um, as far as if something damages my vehicle. We've reached out to the State Department of Transportation for comment on the new report, but we have yet to hear back. However, the agency is urging you to be cautious on the roads ahead of a busy week for Thanksgiving travel, no matter whether you see potholes or not. Reporting in Myrtle Beach, Ali Espinosa, WMBF News.